Hi, I'm Lionel, this is Tech Loto, and this is my video for the Polar Firmware Update 2.0.6. So in this video, I'll also be announcing the winner of the Polar Unite giveaway. So let's get into how to actually update your watch. All you need to do is go into the Polar app on your phone and sync your watch with the Polar app. And once your watch is synced, you'll see a pop-up screen on your phone, giving you the option to update the firmware. Now the update takes about 20 minutes. So make sure during this process, you keep your phone and your watch really close together. If possible, also try and keep it next to your router. So you can either stay there and watch the process or just walk away for 20 minutes. But the basics of what happens is that it restarts your watch, then it starts downloading, then it syncs and updates your watch. And that's the thing with this update, you may not really notice the difference because none of the menus have really changed. So when I say power based training targets and zone pointer, you probably don't think that's very exciting, but it is really good. I've always looked at how this watch can be useful for people who are doing things other than cardio based activities. Well, luckily you can now create power based training targets. So here's how to do it. Go into your Polar Flow app, select the hamburger menu, go to the training section, add a training session to your calendar and select phased target. So you can see in this section, you can define the phase target. This is really cool. You can literally set targets for your exercises based on heart rate, power or speed. And you can set the zone so you can create a timer for warm up. You can add a workout in between and then you can add a cool down section as well, setting your own target zone for each section of the workout. This is really cool. Now this watch can be used for weightlifters. And rather than creating so many sections, you can just multiply this as many times as you want. It would be really cool for Polar to allow us to share these phase targets so that we can share them with our friends and have a synced workout. That would be cool. So if you're having your workout and you're outside the workout zones, the watch will be beeping to tell you. There are a few other things with this update, like being able to name your clock faces, but I think this is the real thing you should be looking out for and you should definitely be trying to implement in your workout program. And congratulations to Rachel, the winner of the Polar Unite giveaway. Please message me using the details on the about section of my channel. But I hope you found this video helpful. Thank you very much for watching.